little smart kid. It's been raining cats and dogs all day. Without stopping, the streets are deserted. Everybody stays at home and drinks warm tea. But our friend Handy Andy is going somewhere. Now he will tell you everything. Where he's going in such bad weather. Hi guys! Despite the rain, I'm ready. Amy called, my close friend, and asked me to pick her up from the train station. It's necessary to help the person because the suitcases she's got are very heavy. It would not be nice that a girl carry them on such a rainy day, and even in an unfamiliar city. I have already started the engine. It is necessary to hurry. Amy is already near the city, but I also need to have time to get to the station before the arrival of her train. And I'll need to find the platform where the train arrives and run to her car. So, let's go, guys. I turned on the windshield wipers, because due to heavy rain flows, I can't see anything. The road will be long and we don't have a lot of time. The asphalt is very wet and I didn't change the tires on the wheels. They're old, without deep treads. That puts the car to the right and to the left sides of the road. The rain is getting worse and there's lightning. Wow, look across all of the sky and the thunder is not a joke. Hopefully I can get there without an incident. Guys, I'm really late. It is necessary to add some speed. And Amy will get wet in the rain when I'm going to get to her. Of course, here's a dangerous road. All winding turn by turn. Faster now. It's necessary to be on time. Oh, uh, I can't cope with the car control. Oops. Guys, I crashed into a pole. At full speed, the crash was very strong. The asphalt is so slippery that the car skidded sharply, but it's my fault. At least I was saved from the hit by the airbags, so I'm safe. But my car, the hood is strongly bent and there's broken lights. It's not clear about the engine's condition. Look, the smoke is coming from under the hood. If there was no airbag, it's frightening to think what would have happened to me. While we're waiting for the police, let me tell you more about the airbag. So, on the body of the car, there are special crash sensors, which are mounted on the front of the car, as well as the front and rear doors. Behind, there are no sensors, because the airbag does not open when the vehicle is hit in the back, or when it is turned. The sensor detects the impact force in a collision and decides to open the airbag or not. There are airbags for the driver and the passengers. These airbags help cushion the blow and protect against serious injury. The driver's airbag is located inside the steering wheel. When a signal is received on the bounce, it shoots out of the steering wheel and is instantly filled with air. Then it slowly deflates. While I was telling you about the airbag, the rain stopped, and the crash does not look so horrible. And here's a police car that rushed to the rescue. Hooray! I'm saved! Police are now calling the tow truck, and my car will be driven to the garage. It is necessary to call Amy and apologize. My friends, be careful on the road. Do not rush, especially when the weather is like today. See you soon! Bye-bye! If you don't want to miss any new cartoons, subscribe to our channel. Also, you can click on the word like 